Hey guys, Joe Twainski here with you for another Diecast review. Uh, this time we will be looking at Chase Elliott's number 8 Aftershocks uh, Xfinity Series Camaro Ford Junior Motorsports that he ran at the Daytona um, Spring? Winter race? I don't know what you want to call it. The first Daytona race in the Xfinity Series and it's his only start of the year. Uh, Chase usually runs that race for Junior Motorsports, or at least he has the last few years. Um, he won it a couple of years ago in the 88 Tax Slayer car. Um, so, just want to look at this car. So, we'll go over to the box. The Xfinity Series boxes are kind of cool. You got the team logo, Junior Motorsports, especially for just this 8 car. Because um, the 8 car has so many different drivers, so they only print they print up the one box for all of them. Except for the Dale Jr. throwback car, which got its own little unique box. But that one makes sense because they're going to make the, a lot of money on that one. Uh, you have the Xfinity Series logo there, and the ages 4 and up. The other side... Ages 4 and up, Action Racing Collectibles, still the choice of champions. Here you got the sticker, Chase Elliott, number 8, Aftershocks, 2019 Camaro Limited Edition, a random code for the car, and then your different 164 designations, your hologram, Action Racing Collectibles, a choking hazard warning, so be careful, because you could choke if you're under 3. And then it says not suitable for individuals under 4 years on the bottom. But the choking hazards for three-year-olds. Just so you know. Just so you know. Uh, and then all your different licensing agreements. So you got the JRM licensing, which goes into the eight. And just, they do a lot of licensing for Hendrick as well. Uh, Lionel Racing, RCCA Elite, and General Motors on the bottom, as well as a Made in China stamp. So, let's look at this car. Uh, Aftershocks ended up coming out of nowhere. They sponsored two cars at Daytona, at the first Daytona race. But they were in different races. They sponsored Chase Elliott. And I don't know if he's got a personal sponsor, endorsement sponsorship deal with them or not. But I know he do, they do with Bubba Wallace, who they sponsored in the cup race. And that's actually his first uh, car that's come out this year. That one, we'll probably, I'll probably have a review on that one up at some point. Um, so let's just dive right in. You got the flatter Xfinity notes on the uh, 2019 Xfinity cars. Um, you got Camaro. Camaro, eight, your different contingencies. It is uh, just Mooj and Edelbrock on this one. You got a little bit, you got the black splitter, and then you got the black design that has kind of this, like, shock-looking thing. Aftershocks, and I'm assuming their slogan is, be open. Bristol is not happy right now. Bristol is my dog, by the way, if you couldn't tell. It's also the little character icon for my channel now. So, just a quick little tidbit. Try to get this camera to focus. It won't, but that's okay. Let's see if... No, nope, that's not gonna help. Anyways, we're getting an overview of this car anyways. So you got your Xfinity, Mobile One, Holly, Mechanics, where your K&N, Simpson, Enduralast, NASCAR race car logo, and then I believe that was a Glenn Wood sticker that's right above that that a lot of the cars ran at Daytona after... Or, not Glenn, um... One of the Wood Brothers. I think it was Leonard, maybe. I'm not 100% sure, and I don't want to tell you the wrong stuff. Um, your orange number 8, which really pops on this car. And then Chase Elliott's signature on the name rail. Junior Motorsports, B-Post, Allsco, Exalta, Aftershocks. There's no B-Open slogan. And then the NASCAR Heat Pro League, which, uh... Yeah, the NASCAR Heat Pro League. And you got your little Aftershocks ripples as well on the side, which is kind of cool little design. If you go to the roof, you have that ripple design again, Aftershocks, Elliot on the back, and the 8 on the top with the orange, which I'm sure helped spotters, you know, having that brighter color, even though it was a single, fi line, single file line fest that first race. On the back, uh, you got Aftershocks, these different uh, Unilever sponsors that Junior Motorsports has, as long as um, Racing Electronics, the number 8. And your decals, as well as the rear camera detail, uh, decal, which I always appreciate the little details. ISM Connect on the back, because that is a sponsor that comes along with um, the Chevy Driver Development Program, which this 8 car is used a lot for this year. Um, or it has been used for, you saw, um, well, Brett Moffat got in the car. I don't know if that was really the driver development side of it, but he did. And then um, Zane Smith, who is the driver, that's the driver development part of it. You also, um, 
kind of is an alliance with GMS in a couple ways as well. So, really solid car. If you're a Chase Elliott fan, you might as well get it. Because I know you're getting all his cup cars anyways, too. Because he has a lot of really awesome paint schemes. Um, I just like to get different, uh, at least one of each Xfinity car number that they make. I didn't get Zane Smith's Cosmopolitan car that came out. Um, and I don't know if I'm going to get any of the other eight cars just because this one is pretty solid. And I like it. Um, and also I have the Junior one, which you probably saw that diecast review already. I just filmed it before this one. Um, so, really cool car. I think you should get it if you're a big Chase Elliott fan. If not, you could maybe, um, if you want to get one of each number, maybe swing towards the Zane Smith car, just because I think that one would give you more longevity if you're using it for stop motions. Um, or you just want to say that you have cars for each driver, which is something I like to do, um, even if I'm not using them for my different stop motions, which you can check out on my channel. You can hit subscribe, or just go to the channel, check out a couple of them, and hit subscribe after if you really like what you see. But this is Joe Towanski, Joe Toe, formerly Race Car Boy 93. I'm going to sign out on this video, and I will see you in the next one.